Before we get into how they're going to improve, hopefully, yes. on the next 20, 40, 60 years, you must come clean. There must be a few things that you have done or do now that would, would age you or maybe aren't the best advice. Oh, are you kidding? <laughs> I, how long do we have? <laughs> um, no, I, you know, obviously I don't exercise the way that I should mm -hmm. and I could, you know, I could afford to lose a, fruit, a few pounds and I'm actually working on that, so. And cocktails, you drink them like the rest of us? Um, occasionally. On, on occasions, I'm really the <laughs> chocolate person. Ah, uh -huh. That's okay. the, so yeah, chocolate, chocolate like yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, so let's go through what might happen. What are their risks? Seriously, they, they seem to be moderate but not heavy smokers and moderate to heavy drinkers. What, what, what are the true health risks? Yeah, well, the four things that are health risks for you all. Obviously, the overdrinking, the smoking, and also you talked a little bit about not having great eating habits and not a good exercise regimen. So if you think about those four things, they're not only gonna age you on the outside, they're gonna age you on the inside. Those four things as risks can actually decrease your life expectancy, how long you live, by up to 14 years. Yes. 14 years, 14 years wow. is a big difference. Uh, yes. Especially That's the closer a, you get to a girl's, yeah, the bigger difference You'll be, you'll be one of those 14 is. years. Yeah. So, so let's, let's dive okay. into the smoking, because okay. I think smoking is a huge risk for you all. And I just want to show you. Uh, oh be, are you ready? <laughs> this is a tough okay. one, girls. It's tough. Brace no, yourselves. Hold yeah, brace again. yourselves for this one. Because um, it's, it's really important, though. Because you said you weren't grossed out enough. Oh, gross. Yeah, oh. let me help you here. <laughs> So I just want to show you what you're doing I can't. on the inside because you can't see it, right? Yeah. So this is a healthy lung. This is a lung that exchanges air really well, mm -hmm. okay? And now let's take a look at the unhealthy lung. This is what is actually happening to your lungs as you smoke. This is emphysema. And I can tell you that this lung wasn't getting a lot of air um, into the body. So these are really important things for you to see and understand. This is what you're doing. Let's go step by step. If they stopped, can that improve? Absolutely. They don't have emphysema yet, but can you get back some of your lung capacity if you stop? Yes, and here's the interesting thing about smoking. Almost immediately, the changes take place. So within about 20 minutes, your heart rate begins to come back down close to normal. Hmm. Within 12 hours, your blood pressure begins to come back down to normal. Within a year of not smoking, your risk for heart disease gets to be about half of what it was when you were a smoker. Wow. And That's over awesome. time, you reduce the risk of both stroke and cancer. So yes, when you stop, your body begins to say thank you yeah. and heal. <laughs> what are we waiting on? And yeah. what are you waiting you on? Know That's what? exactly you right. You can be the same catalyst for each other in any behavior you change. Yeah. You have a mirror image that can root you on. It's definitely a, an advantage to having somebody else by your side all the time to help you yeah. out with it. Because if I were to quit, we're motivators. We motivate yeah, each other. You got to do. You got to do it together. You got to do it together. It'd yeah. be hard well, not to. Imagine the power of motivating each other mm -hmm. to be more healthy. So we're, we're going to take a look now using some age technology. Oh, no. We're going to look at the twins a little differently. On Kara, we're going to see if Kara were aged with the assumption of her making healthy changes what she would look like. And then we're going to use the same process if they do not change their behavior on Corinne. So they should be noticeably different. So Kara, aged with the healthier changes. Couple little light wrinkles. Oh my God. It's creepy, right? <laughs> so creepy. All right, so this represents you aged to 60 years. Gradually it changed there. Yeah. So actually looking really good. Mm -hmm. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so now let's take a look at the opposite. If they keep up the amount of smoking and drinking, let's watch that. Wow, the, the skinny elasticity is the oh. first thing you notice, right? <laughs> and the weight. You okay. Isn't that amazing? Now, of course, this is a suggestion. This is, an, you know, a, a computer app, you know, an age technology. But do you see the huge difference? Yeah. So what, what can they start to do? Like, you're not saying never have another drink no. the rest of I mean, this is about moderation, right? The, exactly. The right. beauty of this is small changes, major effects. Yeah. So if you went to, say, one drink a day, 
if you limited yourself to one drink a day. You would decrease your risk for liver disease and for cancer. You would also decrease um, your risk for um, keeping your weight on so you could lose some of your weight and some of the other negative effects of, of drinking. So you really have an opportunity to change with just that minor change, just a little bit. Yeah. Just a little bit. Well, and the that same goes a thing long with way. And the same thing with smoking. Yeah. I mean, we talked earlier about what a minor change um, or how quickly a minor change in smoking, just stopping in a brief period of time, begins to give you time to repair, and that's really important. And, and you'll also begin to see some immediate changes, like um, if you decrease your drinking, you'll notice that you sleep better. Um, it's that true. Yeah, right not sleeping habits. Wake exactly. up feeling better too. So exactly. So <laughs> yeah, you don't need hangover <laughs> cures, right? Yeah. <laughs> so you can root each other on with immediate good, um, with good feelings as well as the long-term benefits. Mm -hmm.